So, Julian. I have no idea why Peter has chosen me for this task. <laughs> I have no talent in acting. <laughs> Cannot read or write. No, um, the read and the writing is okay. <laughs> I've put you down as being the, the foremost mime expert. <laughs> I know. I'm just hoping I grew the beard especially. I shall be shaving my head next week and having all my teeth removed. So, t tell me what you what you understand by the project. Oh, oh. Is that apple juice? Yeah. Okay. okay, there we go. Thank Fantastic. Oh, lovely. My tea. Oh, amazing. Thank you. I thought it was, yeah. Um, well, basically, um, Peter has been observing me for the last 30 years secretly through a network of spy cameras, and he's turned my life into a play. <laughs> um, uh, yeah, and he somehow got into my brain as well and managed to find out what's going on Stop. there. Well, you put up something on the internet from life, death, and everything in between with uh, a lot of visuals and sound effects. And I thought, God, I really like that. <clears throat> I, you know, I liked the atmosphere of it and what he was talking about. And I'd seen you do poems before about that thing about, you know, one minute we're alive and then we're not. And what, what's that all about? You know, what is that? You know, there's this little bit in between, it's really cram full of stuff. And everyone's trying to work out what it means. And it was, you know, because, uh, and I related and I thought, well, I understand that. I understand that someone's not just accepting that you, you have life and you do it and you, you do stuff. You kind of think, what on earth is going on? What is this all about? So I was, I was attracted to it in that way. So having read the script, you now actually understand everything. Uh, read the script? You. Oh, damn, I knew there was <laughs> something I had to do. You know everything about life, the death. I am no, I am no wiser. I'm no wiser, but I understand the bit in between a bit more. <clears throat> okay, well that's and, good. And also, uh, yeah, and then uh, there are bits in it that Paul Traddle say that are like, and I recognise immediately they were like songs. And I thought, you know, I don't trust my acting, but I know that I can write songs and perform songs. And I, so I turned them into songs, and they were, came very easily and naturally. Um, and it was like Port Travel was writing the songs, not me, because it's not in the style I normally use. So, so that worked. That was good. Excellent. So, what are you looking forward to most? I think the after-show party is going to be really, <laughs> really great. I think I'm always happy when it's. I think we're going to the the sort of tumbleweed time. <laughs> There's always that bit three weeks before the show when you go, oh God, this is actually really crap, isn't it? What are we doing? But uh, I, I always like um, when I'm performing. I always feel much happier and safer when I'm on stage doing it. But I quite like recording the stuff on, uh, on video, making little videos, because that's like performing it. Uh, yeah, rehearsals are, are always, I know they're necessary, but they're always a bit, isn't the real thing. You don't quite know what you're doing. So I'm looking forward to performing yeah. it. Yeah, I mean the point with this is that we can't really rehearse it because the whole thing is going to be a complete mashup at the time. It's going to be a mashup. So uh, yeah, so that I mean it'd be a interesting. Or, we, a, or a road accident. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, we we don't know, and we won't know what it looks like to the audience. We won't know, you know, it's like we've all got an ingredient for the cake we give to somebody else that make the cake. Yeah, the audience <laughs> will be taking the ingredients and making each their own special cake, which will, they will take home with them. <laughs> but I think, uh, what was the word? Um, bewildered, you know, befuddled is the word, I think. Because I'm hoping the audience will go away befuddled and just have these um, little images in their head that they won't quite understand that they'll wake up at that night screaming <laughs> in terror. Good. I think we've okay. covered it all. Thank you very much.